how do LDCs get into debt? Well, an LDC is a less developed country, otherwise known as an LEDC, which are usually found in the southern hemisphere. When they get into debt, they have borrowed money from a richer country, such as the United States or the World Bank. They could borrow money for a number of reasons, which include natural disasters, such as Hurricane Mitch, which put Honduras 50 years back in development at a total cost of £439 million, a lot of which was borrowed from countries such as the United States. Wars often require borrowing of money from richer countries because the army needs to be funded. Depressions also result in the need for borrowing money. This can be brought on because of a lack of trade or if a country doesn't want to buy one of their main exports anymore or another national service could require money. This money then has to be paid back with interest, so the money can't be spent on development in the country, and instead has to be paid back to the richer country, which therefore gets richer, therefore increasing the development gap. Debt cancellations can be of great help to these poor countries. Zambia, which is there, had four, $4 billion of debt cancelled by the United States, which they used to set up a free health care system. This is an example of debt abolition. In Peru, £25 million was cut by the United States in 2008 in exchange for rainforest conservation in the Amazon. Conservation swaps are very useful for rich countries because they can cancel the debt which allows these poor countries to develop and they also benefit because the rainforests are saved. The less developed countries also benefit because they no longer have to resort to logging which is getting rid of their resources and they get their debt cancelled so this works for them as well.